Welcome to another episode of Good. Beer is good. Uh, today we're going to do a beer teeny with yep. olives. We know it was a Bond reference. We know it was douchey. We did it anyway. It was humor, okay? Make fun of us in the comments. Improv! <laughs> yes! Alright, well. All right. So, All right, so we're going to do basically, this is the next episode in our little mini series of garnishes. Um, we're garnishing the same IPA every time. Dogfish Head. Dogfish Head, 60 Minute. minute. Um, and to now we've landed on olives. Um, is this something you found on the forum or was this something you kind of winged? Uh, just wung it? Wung, winged it? I winged it. Winged it? Wang it? Anyways, wang chunks. I thought, you know, it, it, they usually garnish it in a martini, but it's a yeah. beer, beer teeny. Whatever. Yeah. Why not? It sounds delicious. Oh. We're redneck. We don't have martinis around. Oh, God, I hate that. Uh, so hate hard. Olives. Um, oh, it, oh smells. it smells like olives. Can I have one? You can yeah, eat one, you little freak. You, one. Yes. you finger you banging it? Oh, just spray okay. the juice everywhere. Mm. So, mm. who wants an olive and who wants olive juice? I'm gonna try, oh, I'm gonna try oh, it. Oh, juice, yeah, that would work. Alright, you have four. Try one? No, oh, it smells like feet. Like <laughs> dirty sock <laughs> and, and pond water. What it's tastes, not that bad. It, it tastes is. like fetish. <laughs> it's not good. That's awful. Okay. That literally tastes like river water. That no. is awful. It tastes it's like peas. Green olives are really yeah. Peas. It tastes like peas. Maybe like the corn juice, like oh like yeah, canned corn juice, canned corn yeah. juice. Yeah, so you have oh, you, get, you get two whole olives. Two whole olives. Okay. Okay. Maybe less juice is good. Oh gosh. You get some driplets in there. Yeah. Um, I want some juice. You want some juice in I yours? Juice in you can just how much juice? Glasses. Whatever you think. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> you get this much. <laughs> Now you gotta chop yours up now. Yeah, right. I'll just chop a bunch of really, really slice them and dice them. All right, so much start pouring their beer. All right, we're yeah, we're gonna use the same sixty minute IPA. I mentioned, and we're gonna do some gross stuff with olives because uh, this can't make this cannot make an IPA. You good. you're sitting here, you know, moaning. You bought this. <laughs> we realized we put you in charge of garnishes, and you brought this. I was hoping like a fruit IPA. Or like an apple lights PA. How would that be better? I don't know. It's still all of you, Jack. You, you, you got shut floaty, your mouth. Give it to Kevin over there. Gosh, you got floaty taint. Oh, that's nasty. You have two baby olives. I'm chopping up my third one to put in here. Why would you do that? If he has so much juice in his. <laughs> <laughs> it's like all the juice is not even like the foam just stopped at the juice. All right. It's like a black and tan with olive juice and we'll put some one in there. Do we have a towel? Where's that little weird towel? I don't know. It's not trash. Yeah. I got olive juice on the, the towel, towel of shame. Towel of shame. <laughs> this is the towel you had under your bed. Right. There you go. Get a little white. Yeah. All right. So yeah, those two delicious nuggets floating <laughs> right I there. I got this pile of... Oh, dude. You got I pulp. Have, I could have got the chopped IP or the chopped. He did it. I should have. You want to trade? No. I know. I, I, I keep getting the chopped can ones. of chopped. I keep getting the chopped section. Chop suey. Who needs more? You need more. Oh, okay, wow. so look at that. I got a bit of foam over here. What we've been doing is we've been doing the garnishes in three different styles. We have someone who does more of a pulpy style juice. We have the chopped up. We have whole. You keep getting the whole ones. I'm glad. Uh, I nice. keep getting the chopped up. You keep getting like the pulp and the squeeze juice. juice. You yeah. had a juice one time. So. I had one juice. Yeah. Um, what we're doing is basically seeing which way is the best way to put your garnishes in. Or if they're all um, bad. Yeah. yeah. This is very thick foam. It is. You've really ruined yours. That... Did it go down fast? This was awkward. Like, really like olive. olive. No, <laughs> I think it bubbled to the top. Uh, uh, it's salty. God. We started doing uh, the garnish on the side, like the orange peel on the side or whatever. It wasn't really worth it. It was kind of... You kind of smelt it when you took a drink, but... Oh, Lord. Oh. We didn't drink it. Um, it wasn't really worth it. It's so, just a, just now, a show piece. Now we're here. Yep. Okay, yeah, well, go ahead with your two nuggets and two testicles. My two sacks of... And the beer teeny. It, right? Yeah. Shake it, not stir. Honestly, it smells like socks. Does it? Yep. That I guess the two mixing together, just kind of strange. Just take a drink, damn it. That foam was extra salty. I bet that's what this does. Um, not How's much, the beer teeny? Not much change. I don't... I don't get much flavor out of the olives. 
You're wrecked. You're uh, probably gonna be screwed. I'm probably gonna be screwed. Yeah, I minced mine up, and there's olives all in this thing. Mm -hmm. So we'll see crazy. what it's like. A beer teeny. Dude, that's how you take a chunk in. No, you didn't. Um, I just it like tastes like No, to me, it, it absorbed a little of the bitter. Um, I don't really taste any olive. Uh, I got nothing really. Maybe the salt kind of took down. The took bitter. some of the bitter. Yeah. Like if you put salt in coffee, right. just a little bit, a pinch of salt in coffee, it takes the bitter off. Right. So it might have taken a little bit of the pennies away. Yeah. But but I mean, instead of being like sixty pennies, more like forty pennies. <laughs> They're yeah. still there, but just yeah, not strong. So, yeah. yeah. So what did your juice? Well, we, you, you got straight olive juice. I'm gonna have the vinegar and all that. That they you got a significant with. amount of olive juice. And it's definitely saltier. <laughs> I bet it is. It, um, it's like a load in your mouth. Like kind of squeezed one off of your ear. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows what that's like? <laughs> I read a story. I mean, rumors. Rumors. I, I need, it was, we'll have to cut this, but I'll tell you guys. Cause it's no, no, we might leave it in. But uh, we so, got to speed this up, though. So in Forrest Griffin, he wrote two books, right? Okay. And uh, in, MMA fighter. Yeah, in MMA fighter, Forrest Griffin. He wrote two books. One was Gotta Fight. One was Be Ready When the Shit Goes Down. Mm -hmm. First one is just about being a man. The other one's about uh, prepping for Doomsday. They're both hilarious. Right. I've got them both. Anyway, in the um, Gotta Fight, he has uh, different stories about him or that he might tell about someone else. They call him Dick in a Box. Mm -hmm. It's kind of funny. Anyway, so the one guy tells a story about how um, he was going to um, surprise a woman that was pleasuring him. And at the last second, she backed off and aimed it towards his face. And he oh. shot himself in the mouth. Oh, my. Oh my God. And he, oh, that is awful. He said it wasn't that bad. I, oh! I'm that's, who reads these kind of books? <laughs> it that was, was a great story, but we got to end this episode. Oh, yeah. All right. Because you just took okay, okay, 15 minutes of a 10 minute episode. Shut up. Oh, you still wow. have left. Well, well, no, that's good. That was aggressive. That's gone. That's gone. I, I that like was it. aggressive. I like how you did that. Well, that was finished the time crunch. Salt. How was that? that? Extra salty. Yeah. <laughs> basically, uh, that's all that the juice had. Wasn't that salt. bad? Extra mm -hmm. salty. It was basically a but more could you taste story. I, could you taste IPA? I, I didn't taste anything but juice. Oh. Like the juice really overpowered the IPA. Mm. All right, so I'm going to chunk this down real quick. Uh, Oh gosh, Ooh. just chew the chunks and everything. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm not gonna eat mine. Oh. Don't look at me. I know what you're thinking. <laughs> we are brothers. That's don't do that. <laughs> you can be that man. I don't care. I cannot stand those nasty bugs. That was really gross. That's nasty. Mm -hmm. um, it is nothing for the beer, but if you like what? olives, you can taste olives after you drink a beer and eat them. Not yeah. even sure why they put them in any kind of alcoholic beverage, but what do they do for vodka? I don't know. What do they do in beer? Well, just, yeah. what, just don't, put in a, don't put it in an IPA. Uh -huh. Don't put it in an IPA. It's not worth it. Right. But we did it for you. And now you know. If you've ever thought about putting an olive in a beer, who would think that? Burp. I don't know. Why would you think that? We love you. I just thought on the show. <laughs> <laughs> like, share, subscribe. Please share. I, the last few episodes, we've stressed the share part. Send it to one person that likes olives. I don't know. Maybe they'll watch it for 15 seconds and we'll get a view. Maybe a subscriber. Views are good. I don't know. Yeah, yeah views are good. Um, check our Amazon affiliates at, at the bottom. Buy something. It'll really help us out. Thanks for watching. We'll see y'all next time.